Christmas. Republican Representative Tom Emmer says while the federal economic COVID-19 aid package to business and state and local governments isn't the solve all, it can only help. Just imagine we're on uh, this side of the bridge where we've got some trouble. We're trying to get to the other side of the bridge where we can survive. Uh, And then, by the way, when the economy is turned back on, we have our employees. We can uh, downshift this thing and get back moving and, and thrive again. Uh, Minnesota House Republicans were unsuccessful Tuesday afternoon in efforts to lift uh, Governor Tim Walz's stay-at-home order and uh, reopen bars and restaurants. Minority Leader Kurt Dowd says computer models uh, uh, the Walz administration agrees with show no higher death tolls if officials leave a quarantine in place for those who are at the highest risk, which I think is responsible, and it would allow the rest of us to go back to work. Um, And I think this is what Minnesotans are ready for. Uh, But House Democratic Majority Leader Ryan Winkler says... We are doing better than every other state in controlling this disease because we are listening to public health professionals and we, as average citizens and as legislators, are supporting their recommendations. Democrats in the Minnesota House this uh, yesterday afternoon turned back to Republicans' efforts to cancel Governor Tim Walz's stay-at-home order. And uh, Mazeppa Republican Steve Drakowski argues... In our efforts to save lives, we are killing livelihoods. In just the past few weeks, the governor has ordered businesses closed and shut people up inside their homes. Our economy has been smoked. House Democratic Majority Leader Ryan Winkler again responds, Minnesotans are working. We are going to be top in the nation because we are doing the right thing, not because we are quitting. And uh, that uh, is a battle that's going to continue until the stay-at-home order is done.